Welcome back to another Fallout 76 video with me, your host Blackwell here at Blackwell TV. Remember, we are an official ambassador for Green Man Gaming, so check the links in the description below to get money off top games. Anyway, on to today's video. Welcome back, Wastelanders. It's been a few days, but we are back with another daily challenges video for you. Um, it is the 27th of September, and here are your challenges. We've got the gold star if you complete all six. Collect 20 wood, complete a daily up. We're going to re-roll that one right now. Build a light source in a camp times three. Uh, craft or scrap a melee weapon times five. Cripple enemy limbs times six. Kill five canines and scrap junk to produce wood. So we've spawned in and the Aaron Holt homestead because there typically is uh, some wild dogs up in this area. Um, let's see if we can just couple that with the crippling of the limb. Yeah, cripple enemy limbs, kill canines. These two should fit together quite nicely. Uh, so as long as you've got your uh, concentrated fire on or your targeting limbs, you should be okay. As long as you can hit your target, I suppose. Okay, let's get those limbs crippled and get those dogs murdered. There should be some more than just the two. Okay, that's five dogs killed. We can cripple limbs of other animals and people and enemies and so on so that's not too bad i think the toughest one is the canines to be fair uh craft or scrap a melee weapon uh there's a couple of benches around here i don't know if there's a weapons workbench here though i think there's an armor workbench um uh, that's a crippled limbs one done as well so that's good Okay, now we're still being attacked. Let's just take that out. Right, we should be okay now. Uh, collecting wood will go down to Helvetia, because that's our normal spot for that. Cheeky little rad roach having a go at us. Not a fan of that, but never mind. Um, we'll switch over to our energy weapon as well, because we don't have many laser. We don't have any... Um, we don't have many fusion cells so we'll head over to Helvetia we'll switch to our plasma cartridges um and that should see us off for the rest of the day without being in any concern or trouble <sighs> so if you do want to use wood chucker you can for this but you don't have to because there's plenty of wood in the area obviously the forest area is known for having loads of wood everywhere silver 502 has come to join us for this one I see so it's the yellow house just up here you want to be heading to just as they are. Nice. And then you just spam the gather button. And if you don't get all 20, then you can just go a little bit further up the road. They're making noises, but hey, they're not really doing anything. Let's see how many more we need to do here. Uh, we're on 17, that's plenty. Because we can come here. And we get 18, 19, 20. There we go, nice and easy, that one. Sit down, please, thank you. And... Yep, you can do the same. Lovely. Right, so what next on the list? Craft or scrap a melee weapon. Uh, scrap junk to produce wood. Scrap junk to produce wood. You can use your bulk on that one. So let's head over to the weapon workbench, which is in the shed just up the road. It's just here. Kill any stragglers. I love that XP. Yep. Sit down. Okay. Lovely. In we go. Got loads of thirst zappers. I don't need this many. Break some of them down. Well, that's rude. Uh, 
Yeah, uh, I didn't expect that. Just clobbered a one hit on the uh, on the crafting bench. Wow. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> right. Before we were rudely interrupted, I suppose we did turn up to the house and murder their neighbours, but hey ho. Let's get back to the shed. <laughs> that was really funny. Um, okay. We need to craft or scrap a melee weapon, I believe. So we'll make a board. Level 15, I don't know. Uh, you know what? We could actually make some of these. Let's make a bunch of these. And then what we'll do is we'll break them down. And that's technically getting our wood back. So that will be, hopefully, yeah, scrap junk to produce wood. So that's not too bad. If you don't have the access to the bulk, you know, if you don't have your stash box nearby or whatnot, or you don't, you're not near a tinker bench, that's another way of doing things. Nice so build a light source in a workshop or a camp. Just to finish off. We'll head back to Stakeside and we'll get that done. Um, Wasteland Survival is our current playlist. So you are watching this video. It is part of Wasteland Survival. There's loads of hints and tips in the playlist. There's loads of different dailies um, and, you know, run throughs of complete challenges. So if you do want to check the playlist, you'll, you may learn stuff. It may not, it may not necessarily be like today's challenges, um, but you might learn a little bit here and there. I'm still learning myself. I've, I've always put plenty of time and effort into this game, but you can always learn more and more. So, um, so yeah, we're back here at our settlement here. It's our workshop. And then we need to go to light sources. And I've always thought that the easiest ones to make are things like lanterns. You don't need to power them. You don't need to worry about that. Throw three of them down. You don't have to keep them either, you know. Not a bad little ambient there. Or ambience, whatnot. So that's the dailies out of the way. How long that video takes? Seven minutes, seven and a half minutes to get all the dailies done. I think that's a pretty good turnaround. If you did like this video, leave that like, subscribe, and leave a comment if you're new. Um, catch you on the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Peace and love to you and yours, and I'll see you on the next one.